Friday night football from Marvel Stadium. Hello and welcome. We have the roof open and the benefit of the moonlight to help illuminate the ground tonight. All in all, a good turnout for this particular match. Accompanying me is Gary Lyon. Hi, Hutto. Tonight's an exciting one. Tonight, it's Western Bulldogs at home against Carlton. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp, and the crowd are appreciating it. The banners are ready for the players. Let's go. for a big day here. This could be a high scoring affair and both sides would want to make the most of their chances inside 50. Western Bulldogs make their way onto the field ready to put in another big performance. I'm really looking forward to seeing how they play today. You're right, Hutto. Captains of both sides make their way to the middle for the coin toss. Western Bulldog kicking to the left of screen. Just over a month into the season and we are getting a clearer picture of the contenders at this early stage. Already we've started to see the game evolve again this season. Some new tactics in play and teams coming out firing. It's been exciting stuff. The opening siren is moments away and you can feel the excitement building. And here we go. It's Western Bulldogs taking on Carlton. A chance for Dangerfield. The handball hits the target. Dug out the loose ball. He takes it across the line. Going for goal number one. It'll be a throw-in. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gabs? There's some great skills on display right now. A great match. There'll be a ball up close to goal. Wins the ruck duel. Dangerfield has the ball. Marks all alone. It's a turnover. Turned it over. Cochin drives it out of the pack. A stab kick from Gibbs. Rosie won himself a free. Moving on. Going for goal number one. A mark by Andrews. Bangs it on the boot now. Brayshaw determined to reach the ball. We'll get a ball up. Hipwood won the hit out. Put his body on the line. Hurried kick. Finding the loose ball was Castagna. He spears the ball. May wins the foot race. Go for goal number one. Pierce slots the goal. He's enjoying that goal. Puts the first goal on the ball. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. That's a really good team goal. We resume hostilities. Bell Chambers gets it down. Mitchell just gets it onto the boot. Sicily couldn't keep his hands on it. Pierce couldn't stick the tackle. It's cut off by Dunkley. Mops up the loose ball. The ball spills to Lloyd. Rosie has it. Gets the handball away. Slips the handball to Sinclair. Mops up the loose ball. Hands that ball to the opposition. 
Ball picked up. Gets a quick kick away. Marked by Dunkley. Pumps it inside 50. Good mark. And looks to send it back. Robertson tucks it into the pocket. Takes a nice mark. Puts it on the boot. Simply outplayed his opponent. Decides to go to the middle. Pierce was surrounded. He needed to mark it. And he did. Heads long with that kick. Takes the mark. Putting this one through would give Carlton plenty of confidence. He decides to go for home. But just misses the kick. Carlton by seven points. Houston with the responsibility of kicking it in. Works the ball up the ground. Greenwood grabs that one. Did well to get a hand in. Mitchell gets the loose ball. Wins the race to the ball. Andrews missed an opportunity to mark. Gets a quick kick away. Manages to get a hand to it. May just put it on the boot. O'Brien did well to win that ball. A long driving kick. Finds a target. He's a long way from home, but he might have the wheels. Rosie going for number one. Marks in a bit of space. Houston hoping to kick truly with this shot. Going for goal number one. He's excited about that one. Western Bulldogs get there first. The game is back underway. Tap came from Bell Chambers. May was taken high in the tackle. Keep it on. Uses it now. Trying to avoid everything out there. Puts on the afterburners. Gets it away. The ball in the hands of Castagna. He gets another possession. He loved that one. The Blues by seven points. We're back in the middle to resume play. Guided down nicely by Bell Chambers. Hipwood puts it to his advantage. Handballs to no one in particular. Goes off the ground. Can he put it through? Dangerfield sinks it from a long way out. He puts through his first goal. Smiles all round. About to resume hostilities. Bell Chambers dumps it forward. Giving it off with Cannington. Just through the ball. Cunnington drives it long. Castagna uses the body well. This shot should be elementary from here. Going for goal number two. Carlton fans getting excited about that one. Pretty happy with that one. Carlton by seven points. Centre bounce. Bell Chambers lose the contest. Has it now. May goes to the man on the run. Cunnington picks up the loose ball. Goes with the kick. Winning the ball in the air was Castagna. Slams it on the boot. Mitchell marks. Converting these opportunities could make a big difference to today's result. Kerner takes it strongly. So what can Carlton do with this opportunity in front of goal? He pops through the goal. Gets his first. Kuno loves that goal. What did you make of the first term, Gaz? Carlton deserved this lead early. They'd want to keep it up if they're going to win this. The game was fairly open for the first quarter with plenty of goals to be had.
Here's Gary to take a look at the key stats. Western Bulldogs have been better around the contest, but they need to make the most of that stat and put it on the scoreboard. Thank you very much, Gaz. We're ready for second quarter action. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. He's got the football now. He can take off after that handball. The ball ends up going to ground. Gets the ball out of heavy traffic. Cochin used the body to take that mark. Elects to kick. Good mark there. Sicily elects to kick. Goes for territory. Finding the loose ball was Robertson. Doesn't take the mark. Pushes through with power. Finds himself in space and marks. And now we'll have a ball up. What can you tell us, Gaz? It's a really good contest out there right now, and it's great to watch. Cochin throws the ball away. Takes the mark all by himself. 50 metres out. Lloyd with an opportunity for goal. 45 degree angle. A chance to reload the attack now. Works it from the back half. Well up. Hangs on to that one. Uses it by foot. Doing well with the mark. 65 metres out. A 45 degree angle for this shot at goal. Does well to cut off the kick. Moves it by foot. Moore found a way to mark that one. Just handballs into space. Getting in the way was Hoskin Elliott. Drives it out of the pack. Takes that one stronger. The distance might be just beyond him. Jones takes a strong mark. Carlton are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Lloyd with a chance to light things up. He blasts it through for another. That's his first. This kick stretches the lead. They get around him after that effort. Back in the middle now. Bell Chambers won the hit out. Somehow got the handball away. Just gave it away. Puts boot to ball. He takes the mark. Kerno kicks it. Dawn did well to win that ball. Channels a long kick. Hacking it out of there. Takes a simple grab. Needs a big kick if he's going to put this through. Morrison going for number one. What a lovely goal from there. Congratulated by his teammates. 25 points the difference. Back with another centre bounce. Hipwood just swats it away. Cunnington short by hand. He can take off after that handball. A drop part through the goal. May could be upset with that. Gets some reward for his efforts. Carlton have kicked the last five goals. The margin is 31. Kicks hurriedly. 
A strong pack mark. Sicily goes with the kick. Had plenty of the ball. Moved on by Kuno. Takes a nice mark. It has to be a big kick to get it from there. Lloyd just bangs away a goal. He just sets the ball well. With a driving kick. Nice work from Robertson. Clearing kick out of the defensive 50. Looks up with the kick. Morrison gets in the way. Fighting hard was Jones. Finding the ball with ease. Hall does well to mark. The Blues haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. That's holding the ball. Great tackling there, Hutto. A low stabbing kick. Stands tall and marks. Carlton haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. Ends up turning this ball over. Showing control was Greenwood. Couldn't quite with the mark. Somehow got the ball out. Hits him hard. Mitchell just goes bang. Hall with the ball. Coughed up by Andrews. Suckers are through for a goal. Houston kicks his second. Right when they needed it most. Look at him. He really enjoyed that one. Western Bulldogs reduce the margin. Bell Chambers hurls it away. Picks up the loose ball. Unable to create the space. Great tackle. Morrison picks up the loose ball. Seen plenty of it. Drops the mark. May gains possession. Advantage. Well picked up. Picked up now. Cousins drives out the tackle. Can't take the mark. Uses the hands instead of the body. And it's a free kick. Moved on by Dunkley. Strong mark in the contest. Dawn elects to kick. Stuck the bits out there and held on to it. Uses it across half back. A chance to reload the attack now. Looks to move it by foot and the mark will be paid. They can't afford to be wasting these shots at goal from the corridor. Drop punt straight through the middle. They stretch their lead with that effort. He celebrates hard after that. Carlton, the siren sounds, and that's the end of the term. The scores, the Blues, 49, the Bulldogs, 18. Carlton could have had a good first half. I think they'd really love to stamp their authority on this contest in the second. What do you make of it all, Gaz? Carlton are gaining a lot of their advantage through some smart kicks and even better marking inside their forward 50. Thanks for that, Gary. Everyone takes a collective breath and we'll return with the second half. Second half action about to commence. Back in the middle now. Bell Chambers with a punch. Daw controls this one. Manufactures the handball. He goes for broke. Kerner goes long and delivers the goal. They increase their lead. His teammates rush over. That's two in a row for Carlton. The lead is now 37. A great bit of play that resulted in that goal. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. Carlton could have actually turned it over more than the opposition, but they haven't allowed that to translate into scores. It's why they're still in front. About to resume play. Bell Chambers with the hit. Mitchell gets it out of congestion. The ball mopped up. Gathers it now. Slams it onto the boot. Over the top of the pack. 30 metres out. He drives it towards goal. They get the goal through to Stanya. He acknowledges the crowd. Carlton Lee is now 43. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. 
This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. Carlton haven't been winning the ball as often around the contest, but it's what they're doing after the initial contest that sees them in the lead. Back in the middle. Has the rucks go at it. Thump clear. Opportunity for Bell Chambers. Nice mark under pressure. Castagna continues to dominate this contest. He's having a fantastic game. Lloyd marks it. Chance to put one through for his side. 45 metres out. Looking to kick. Goal number two. Sends it home. And that puts them further in front. Lloyd love kicking that one. The lead is now 49. Umpire ready to resume play. Hipwood got the tap. Cousins, interesting handball. Hands it out to open space. The loose ball picked up. Couldn't take it. Harbrap not getting much of it, guys. Maybe the coach needs to go on the phone to him and give him some instructions. Western Bulldogs produce the margin. Teammates break for him. The mark has been taken. Connor Jasny clearing kick out of the defensive 50. Gets the loose ball. Wellock sticks the tackle. Big tackle. Does well to cut off the kick. Goes by foot. The ball finds Mitchell. Packs it forward. It's a foot race to get this one. The ball spills to Morrison. Works it across the ground. Pierce wins the ball in the air. 45 metres out. He gives it a ride. The top punt goes straight between the big sticks. Puts his second on the board. This kick puts them further into the lead. Pierce celebrates with the fans. Won the hit out. Made the tricky bounce look easy. Kerno slick with the hands. Rushes with the kick. Strong with the body and wins the mark. Robertson goes with the kick. Great mark taken there. Got boot to ball. Great mark. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. The Blues forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Well, he hasn't had the impact we were expecting. Morrison looking to put through another goal. A long effort at goal, and it goes all the way. Look at him. He really enjoyed that one. Carlton have kicked the last six goals. Now they lead by 60. Just gets it onto the boot. Nobody can hold on here. Hoskin Elliott failing to get near it, Gaz. You're right, Hutto. He's gone missing lately. My ball, says the umpire. Right now, I'm only seeing one team really putting their all into this contest. Houston throws the ball away. Looks to move it by foot. Finds the loose ball. I haven't seen it for a while, Gaz. That's right, Hutto. He just can't seem to get into the game. Clumsy tackle results in a free kick. Chose to kick it. Takes it well. Goes by foot. Takes the mark. He drives it. Good body work to win the mark. He slams it towards goal. Couldn't snap it. I haven't seen it for a while, Gaz. Yeah, he barely touched the ball, honey. The Blues, 80, play Western Bulldogs, 19. Considering the options on the kick-in. Ryan doesn't take the mark. Going for goal number one. He sums up the situation and delivers. Yes, Hutto. Look at them celebrate that effort. Carlton have kicked seven unanswered goals. 67 points the difference. We're back in motion. Slapped away. Kerno with a clean collect. Gibbs knows they desperately need this one. Can he deliver? 
Shows some physicality. Applies a bump. Harbrand, the recipient of the free kick. Sinks the slipper into it. Smith takes the mark. Goes with the kick. Kolejasny with an easy mark. Slams it on the boot. Brayshaw got hands to it. Goes short by hand. Ends up turning this ball over. Carlton just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside the Kerno kicks it to the square. Cousins with a shorthand pass. Ball up in the centre square. I hate to say it, Hutto, but this game is over. Fails to fend off the tackler. Outstanding pressure. Finds this one all by himself. 20 metres out. Move it on. An opportunity for a third goal. His teammates rush over. Western Bulldog trying to work their way back on the scoreboard. We're back in motion. Won it down. He's got the footy in his hands. Wants to keep it moving. He's getting a lot of the ball gas. He's really having a big impact on this game. Ball up call. Thumps it clear. They can create from this. Just put it on. As we go into the final change, the scores are Carlton 86, Western Bulldogs 25. A big final term coming up. Carlton believe they can win this game. It's time to show it. Plenty of scoring opportunities in the third term. It'll be interesting to see which team can capitalise in the final quarter. Here's Gaz to break down the stats. Carlton are getting plenty of marks with loose players. They're really able to control the game and move at their own pace. Thank you, Gaz. One quarter of footy to go. They have to go quickly to have any chance from here. Guides it down. Cunnington keeps coming. Castagna wins the marking contest. Uses it now. Dunkley needs to lift. He's barely touched the ball lately. Brings it out of the pack. Taking a nice grab. Kurnow with a chance to line up for goal. 20 metres out. Hold on to the ball for a few moments and just take the sting out of the game. He might kick a goal. That kick was pure. He's enjoying every second of it out there. Puts through his third goal. This one gives them a bigger lead. He's enjoying that goal. Thumped by Bell Chambers. Constricted by Mitchell. Fantastic pressure there. Punches the kick. May couldn't snaffle it. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. He needs to find a way into this game. Stands tall and marks. Drives the kick hard. Doing well to intercept that kick. Puts it on the boot. He gets another possession. Moore can link up through hands. May had it, lost it. Well taken at ground level. Couldn't complete the mark. Dug out the loose ball. Bye, didn't mark it. A bit too hard with the push, and it's a free kick. A chance to put one through here, Carlton. 40 metres out. Goes for the goals. Bach gets a reward for effort with that kick. This kick has extended their lead. Celebrating hard. Carlton have kicked back-to-back -back goals. Margin getting dangerous now. It's great to watch, Hutto. Plenty of excitement. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score.
Back in the middle now. Wins the ruck duel. Couldn't get the hand pass away, so he just threw it. The kick from Dangerfield. A clean pickup. Knew where his teammates were with the ball now. Off hands from Wood. The ball spills. Cochin coming off for a spell. The umpire will ball it up. The sting has been taken out of the game right now. Dangerfield earns a free kick. Western Bulldogs fans would love to see this one sail through. Moore looks to get onto the football. Puts it into space. Ball gets cut off. Picked off the deck. The loose ball scooped up. Goes through. Oh, really needed a goal there. The Bulldogs now only trailed by 72. Great mark in the pack. Paul uses it by foot. Heaney couldn't keep his hands on it. Landed in his back on this occasion. Bell Chambers wants to keep it moving by hand. Connor Jasny with a spearing kick. Marks now and can send it back. Doesn't cover much ground with that kick. Releases the handball. And now Morrison, now under pressure. Great attack on the ball carrier. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Bell Chambers won the tap. He has the ball. It's a turnover. Is in his possession. Now we've got a ball up. Bell Chambers just slaps it down. Clean pick up by Dangerfield. May making his way onto the field. Thrown in now. He's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. Well, it gets the loose ball. Just put his hands in the back of the opponent, and it's a free. Elects to kick. Steady hands there as he holds that one. Sicily puts it on the boot. Ryan found some space and marked. Carlton just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside field. Might be too far out to score. Castagna can put for a fourth with this kick. The drop part sails between the big sticks. Pretty happy with that one. That's three in a row for Carlton. This margin is becoming a bit of a task to peg back now. They just need to find a way to work back into the game right now. Has a man running for him. Goes by hand to Morrison. He likes his chances from here. The drop punt goes straight between the big sticks. Three goals so far. Great start. He celebrates hard after that. The Blues, but 84. Centre bounce. Taps it down. Bell Chambers there to mop up. Castagna has the ball. And now we'll have a ball up. Bell Chambers armed it down. Now it's a ball up. Bell Chambers thrashes it. Charges with intent. Hurried kick. Harbrack spills it. Does well to keep it in play. And the ball ends up over the line. Kerno runs onto the field. Looks like we'll have a throw in. Toss back into play. Thrashes it. Collected by Robertson. Oh, someone's on the ground. Gary, what do you think it is? Doesn't look good, Hutto. It's hard to see him coming back on. Scoops up the ball. Well, it looks in need of a spell. Paul has a great set of hands. Moves it by foot. A race for the loose ball. He's on fire at the moment, Gaz. He has been outstanding here, Hutto. Tries to release the pressure. Picking it up was Kerno. Oh, 
My ball, says the umpire. Tap down. Higgins dug out the loose ball. Fantastic tackle. Quickly onto the boot. Easily takes the mark. Western Bulldogs were really poor today. Your final word on today's game, Gaz? Just a really poor performance. They would have expected a better result given the effort we've seen them have recently. Thanks for that. The final result is the Blues 110 to the Bulldogs 26. On behalf of Gary Lyon, thank you for joining us. We'll see you again soon. Against the famous old dark blue.